Allow me to explain. I get a phone call from a guy who I don't know from Adam's house, Cat, and he identifies himself as a police chief in a small town in North Carolina that I've never heard of. I would like to talk to my attorney first. He says, we would like to buy a commercial building in Wilmington, North Carolina. Oh! How can I help, officer? His other boss is Mr. Rusty Barr, and while that name may not sound familiar, I promise you their mission is. If you've lived in Wilmington for any amount of time, you know that the iconic sign that the holidays are here is when that huge blow-up inflatable pumpkin goes up at the corner of Independence and Shipyard Boulevard. For more than 40 years, some generation of the Barr family has been bringing their pumpkins and Christmas trees from Crumpler, North Carolina, down to that lot to bring the holidays to all of us. Problem, that lot was just sold for a gas station to go in. Now, I know that you're relieved because the gas station directly across the street was clearly not enough. I also know that you're disappointed that it's not a Dollar General. Breathe through the pain. Now they have nowhere to go, which means Christmas can't come and I'll not have that. We begin our search, we strike out, we strike out, we strike out, and then I see it. 37 Koval. There's a small building up front and then there's acreage in the back. I have this this vision where I see that little house all decorated up for Christmas and then in the back there's this circular driveway so people could pay for their tree, circle around, get it loaded up. We would be like the Chick-fil-A of the North Pole. So people can let their kids and their dogs run free and have fun. They don't have to worry about them getting hit on a busy intersection by some garbage pickup truck like the Ford Lightning specifically. I send this listing to Mr. Barr. No, nope, that's not gonna work for us. Yes, it is. Try again. Nope, 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 not gonna work. They come back down to town to look at a couple other things and I get a phone call from Mr. Barr that says, hey, I'm at this place on 37 Koval and this would be just perfect. Would it? Would it be just so perfect? Dear Lord and Santa Claus, please grant me the serenity not to choke this man out, but the strength to do it if that is your will. We are at the end of the finish line now. It is closing day. I don't know every farmer in the United States of America, but I know enough of them to know that they work a thankless job because the general public still thinks that the food is grown at the grocery store and politicians in general don't pay any attention to them until there is a highly advantageous reason to do so. What we don't need more of in America is useless celebrities and influencers. What we need are the people who are willing to do the backbreaking work of working the land to feed a nation. That's what should be celebrated. And so today, perhaps for one day only, we are going to make him feel like the celebrity that he is. We shall call it a Christmas closing miracle. Subtle, but not garish. This actually fits. Thank you. Thank you.